start readings before the crank 34 events uh, that's a 23.9 it's gonna do an actuary test we test on the Chamberlain and hook and meter power factor fit meter still awaiting new resistors this meter I got from my good friend James James H and uh, we're gonna give that a test with a 3 kilowatt uh, load on it I've got it hooked up to one of the phases to the load banking device okay energized device Okay, here we have a Chamberlain and Hookham meter, made in Birmingham, United Kingdom. Meter was built in 1956. The disc constant is 300 revolutions per kilowatt hour. Meter is rated at 40 ampere maximum for a supply voltage of 230 volts. You have a close-up look on the disc. There's hardly any disc wobble in the meter, so it's actually a very good uh, balanced disc. Um, no float-on bearings, just uh, dual bearings. There's a steel ball between two sapphire cups on this particular meter. British engineering at its best. And we let the dial spin for a wee while. Beat electromechanical equipment regarding reliability for a 64 year old meter. The final Chamberlain and Hookham meter reading ended up as 20.4, the Actaris meter at 29.5. Over the 3.15 kilowatt hours measured, no actual error observed. Talking about quality.